this is Ono here. Hello, hello. We're playing Vex's new map. It's called Waking Up. It's just released a couple days ago. And we're here on Minecraft 1.1, 1.3.1, sorry. Just new, haven't played anything with it. I've looked at this map already a little bit, and I died pretty good. About two minutes in. So I decided to restart it and record, and we'll see how it goes. Looks pretty tough already. I grabbed these books just for an enchanting table later. Grab those note blocks just because note blocks are awesome. You never know when you need a switch. Your guide to lucid dreaming. Let's see what that says. Take a chest. You always need chests. Alright, let's read this. New thing in 1.3. Reading and signing books. Just right click to use it. Your guide to lucid dreaming. A lucid dream is one in which the dreamer is aware that he is dreaming. The dreamer is able to control or direct the content of the dream as he dreams it. Wow. Allowing himself to explore his creativity, work through issues plaguing him in waking life, and even subvert nightmares. When attempting to induce a waking lucid dream, it is imperative to recognize the hypnagogic, hypnagogic state and to maintain consciousness during it. When a dreamer can stay away aware during this stage of the process, it is more likely he will be able to enter a dream while lucid. Alright. Let's see. It looks like about everything here. Press escape to skip the cutscene. Yeah, okay. I've, s I've seen this already. This is pretty cool. He actually started this map in the end which I never would have expected. He started all of his maps in the overworld, as far as I know. So that was kind of a surprise. Welcome to Super Hostel number 14, Waking Up, by Vex, for Andy B. Rules. Find and complete the Victory Monument. Use at least easy, never peaceful. We're on normal, so... Let's see how that goes. Do not leave the map boundaries. Find wool and chests. Do not use sheep, dye, spider silk. Survive in any way you can think of. You may craft the metal blocks for the victory monument. You may use spider string wool for non-victory monument uses, i.e. beds. So for those of you who had never played a Vex map, he's got a victory monument where you have to gather different colored wools and place them on there. But you have to gather the wools from certain chests. You can't just make them. grab some of this glowstone for lighting later because I find I'm always short of light and from what I've seen playing the first little bit of this map I need anything I can get my hands on definitely grab this wood too Usually his maps are resource limited. He doesn't give you a lot to start out with, but once you get enough stuff, you just kind of build a base and work from there, trying to get the wool. There's a spider already. Stupid thing. So this wood will come in handy to make some sort of weapons, I guess. And this is smooth stone, so... This is my spawn area though, so if I die I might want to leave some light here. Okay, so let's see what he's given us here. I should have left that one. Andrian paper cutter level one. Sharpness 3 paper. That's neat. Gold Sander. Bane of Death. GSLK. I don't know what that means. Smite 4 knockback 2 looting 2 gold sword. <laughs> that won't last very long, but 
They're better than nothing, I guess. Okay, I'll throw some light here. So since this is my spawn point and I'm probably going to die, I'm going to leave one of these chests here with all this good stuff in it. Here's another thing. Be sure to check out the book at andybuchanan.com slash wakingup.html or you can Google search Andrea waking up in quotations. So apparently, I, I think it's over here. Bonus goal. Find all 20 chapters of Waking Up. So around the map, he's also hidden 20 chapters from this book that must be by this Andy Buchanan. It looks like a pretty interesting book. I read the first chapter already when I was playing it before. Okay, we'll leave that here too, because I am going to die, most certainly. The Sharpness 3 paper is actually pretty useful. You see all the mobs spawning here already? It's hardly even dark. A creeper over there. Oh, yeah, and the game's running. Kind of how SMP runs instead of single player. The game sounds sound too loud. I hope that pauses it. Let's go with 40. Music might as well turn on. Alright. Let's get these guys. Oh, man. There we go. Let's see some more of this wood here. Make sure nobody's coming after me. I left F3 up. I'll leave it up. It's kind of handy to have, I guess. I'm at Y28, foot level now, they show, instead of just the eye level. I like that. That's it. He doesn't know what to do. zombie meat. One more hit on you. Come on. Oh, shit. Die. That's close. Oh, get away from me. Get away from me. No, get away from me. Stay down there. Oh my god. I should have brought that sword so I can block. again. Oh, this is such a tough start. Right over there. That's hell. Right there's hell. There's a chapter of a book, but that's hell, and that's as far as I got. I didn't even get over there. So, already this is ridiculous. <sighs> Give me some blocks. I think this is here so that... Well, it's probably too far away. There's a bunch of creeper spawners in there. And it's not good. We'll read this chapter. And then we'll go tackle the creeper spawners. Oh, two golden apples. That's good, too. Take this, too. Alright, let's get out of here to read this. Because... The bonus goal is to keep all these chapters safe. We're going to try to do that. Hopefully, successfully. Damn guys spawning. Do not blow. Oh man. Do not blow. I don't want to blow. be blown. Don't blow me. Skills. 
I don't know what time of day it is. Let's read this first. Let's eat something first. Can you get better? Okay, let's read this guy. What is it? Chapter 1 by Person of Interest. Waking up by Andrea J. Buchanan. So it is by that girl, I guess. Andrea. Copyright 2012. Between living and dreaming, there is a third thing. Guess it. Antonio Mercado. I have no idea who that is. But that's a great quote. Chapter 1. For as long as I can remember, I have felt something in my chest. A lightness, a flutter, a visceral ache, when something nears its end. I feel it when I'm about to say goodbye to someone, even when I know I'm going to see them again soon. I feel it when I reach the part of a story when everything starts to come together, and I know it's just a matter of time until it's over. I feel it when my mom says goodnight and walks out of the room, her back facing me as she departs. There's an edging towards something final about it, something about all... Uh, but my words are broken. About all of these almost endings, and my heart strains and races until I could swear I can actually feel it swelling. This feeling doesn't only announce itself at important times. Obvious moments when something is ending and something's beginning. I feel it in small moments, too. When I see the lonely blink of the cursor on my screen. When someone closes the door as they leave the room. I feel it at the end of a data transmission on the ultranet. At the end of dinner. At the end of a song. At the end of a sentence. Endings are hard for me, I guess. Because what comes next? But this feeling in my chest, longing, it's not exactly unpleasant. I don't feel sad. I don't even actually feel bad. I just feel this itchy emptiness, this restless sense of restless sense of needing to wander that fills me up for just a moment before, like the very events that triggered it, it ebbs away. I am feeling it now. I ache with it. I am suspended in a permanent ending, and so I am bathed in longing, and now this longing has a point. It isn't the shapeless pain of knowing something is about to be over. It's the pointed, focused pain of not knowing when the end will come. I am floating, captured here, waiting, and the feeling in my chest refuses to subside. That's beautiful. And that's just chapter one. That's amazing how well written that is. Right, we're going to put these in a special chest right here. Chapter one. And the intro. I think. Yeah, kind of the intro. Okay. It's put this stuff away. I wonder if that is the really really intense golden apple or if that's the regular golden apple because there's a new golden apple that you make out of you make it out of uh, gold blocks instead of gold ingots and it gives you regen for like two minutes and fire resistance and all sorts of good things. Whoopsie daisy. I'm gonna make a... what the hell am I making? I think I'm making a pick. Get some more stone. Fire resistance and a whole bunch of stuff. And I think it might be that one that's blue. We'll test it when we go over to the creeper spawner. I'm gonna try to get some stone here first for a sword at least. The sharpness 3 paper is handy, but I like to block. Put this back. Don't need any of that. Uh, yeah. We'll try this right now. I'm hungry. So hungry. Not in real life. I just had supper. Or dinner, depending on where you are. Breakfast, even. Whatever you like to eat. Oh, it is so eerie. So eerie down here. I don't like it. You get away. Don't hit me. Dude. Dude. Where the hell? Okay. Get that like that. I should have brought some blocks. This is not very safe the way it is right now. And that's all gravel. 
with a gap in between, so as soon as I touch it, block near it, it's going to fall down. I'm stuck in this hole. Wow. I was stuck in nothing, actually. I don't know why I was stuck. It's glitchy Minecraft, I guess. Minecraft. I watch Minecraft. Sometimes I say Minecraft. I don't know. Holy shit. That is scary. Pardon my French. If you're young and watching this, or religious, then you have a problem with curse words. Oh my god. Oh my god, I did not expect that. I did not even think about that. That didn't happen last time. I think I'm gonna eat this. Yeah, I'm gonna eat this. Oh, that's just a regular golden apple. Shit. Oh my god, look at all those creepers. Oh my god. I don't even know what to do. I'm at a loss of words. I'm gonna go down there. It looks a lot funner down there. More fun. It looks more fun down there. There's shit below me. Stuff. There's shit below me. That's, that's shit. That's just a lot of shit. Yeah, that's a lot of shit. That creeper up there. I don't want you up there anymore. Holy hell. Give me some more string. Shoot me. Come on. A little closer. Give me like an enchanted bow. Like power one. That would be awesome. Wow. That was a good crit. Good crit hit. Crit hit. I'm like a hipster or something. Crit. I don't say crit. These guys don't see me. Don't look at me. You see me? He should definitely be able to see me. I think this is glitchy SMP single player that is the case. Don't touch me. Oh, I want to get to that chest really bad and that coal. Look at it. And there's wood there. And trees over there. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. Oh, 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 you still don't see me. Oh, you see me. Boom, baby. Damn it, guy. Shit, yeah, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. Whoa. I'm so scared. I don't know why I'm whispering. I'm so scared that I whisper. That's what I do when I get scared, I whisper. Holy hell. Holy hell. Let's make a run for it. I have one light. I'm gonna die, though, if that skeleton shoots me. Yeah, there's... I gotta regroup. I gotta regroup. Maybe I can make a bow. Oh my god, he's gonna kill me. Oh. Oh. Oh my god, I haven't died yet. That's pretty awesome. It didn't happen before, I died about half a dozen times in the- Oh, in the first two minutes. I finished my sentence, kill this guy. Oh my god! Yes, I can make a bow. I'm whispering again. I have four arrows, I can make a bow. I am as happy as... A, a mountain lion with a with like a, a pork chop or like a live pig they'd probably be more happy with a something that's alive I suppose maybe if I wait here those things will despawn that'd be great oh I need food too I don't have any food I've got a spider eye that's all I have is a spider eye and I've got the I got burps too. That's about it. I wonder if he 
hit any. I wonder if he hit anything up there. I keep whispering. I don't know why. I shouldn't do that. Makes more light. Okay. Let's go again. Oh, I need food. I gotta take this and this. I have to. Um, what should I take first? If I take this, yeah, I'm gonna regen health anyway. Doesn't matter. Alright, let's go. Come on, give me health. Give me health, come on. Come on. Health, health, health. I know I'm gonna lose hunger if I jump. Don't jump. Don't jump. Just crawl. Zombie above me. This is too dark. I do not like how dark this is. Too dark. Creepers there. Frick, man, I'm gonna use up all my light sources on you dumb guys. Oh my god. I thought I had him. I was certain I had him. I was obviously wrong, though, because he had me. He sure had me. Damn chest is gonna burn. Oh man, let's go over there. Quick, before those creepers come back. Let's put up some light. Kill them all or something. Something crazy. Something crazy. Come on. Oh my god. Oh my god, there's too many of them. Man. Freaking guys. Yeah, you fall off. You just fall off of there. No! Oh my god. Yeah. Frick. Oh, you guy. You better drop arrows. Oh my god. You're hurting me. I got an arrow. I'll kill you. You should die. Yes. Two arrows. I'm gonna go down there. I have blocks with me. Let's see what's down there. Oh my god. Pokey pokey. Oh my god. God, die, man, die, man. Where am I getting hit from? Oh, that was so lucky. Alright, I am. Um, I'm gonna stop recording here. I gotta not pee my pants.